This is Twit. So I've committed myself this year to find apps that can that work just as well as the Google apps and offer access to that, but aren't made by Google. So I'm trying to basically, I'm challenging myself to find like a replacement for all the apps that I'm used to using directly from Google. And this is just to kind of like get out of my bubble. Uh, and also because I realized that, you know, not all Google apps offer everything that I want. So the first thing that I decided to tackle was my Google Drive. Now, this app is not for the full Google Drive. This app is just for the images in my Google Drive. And the reason this is important is because A, not only do I, am, not only am I hauling around a bunch of screenshots and, you know, images that I need to turn in with articles to editors, but I also am a mass collector of memes. Uh, and so I need to have those things with me at all times. Marie Kondo, that stuff. Well, Wh which means give, they you all, they all give me joy. <laughs> uh, so if we come over here, the app that I brought is called G Folio Google Drive Photo Gallery and Uploader. Now, this thing offers a whole bunch of stuff. All right, now I'm praying that this is safe. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to show you. Um, a new thing that I'm getting into because I'm realizing that like people just pick up your phone and do stuff on it if they need something from it. And if they know your pattern, which most people in my life know mine, uh, you have to password protect some things. So I've started to use apps that pa actually password protect. So thank you, Victor, actually, because I do need to put in my code. So I'm going to put in my code right now. Um, or you can use a fingerprint. To unlock it and now I have now I have a bunch of images here so it's my visa application <laughs> so you know <laughs> like all the things you need right I have my Sailor Moon memes uh, I have all my screenshots for my articles at Android Police. You have your Know How IoT. I have my no Well, this, this is stuff that was shared with me, and so this was shared with me, my Anthony, and so now you mm -hmm. know I have this beautiful picture of me and Megan, which I'll always like hold dear to my heart. I always have, I have my 90 Day Fiance memes, which I used to send to my friend. I'm really into you know. I, I really tried to <laughs> to make my life. M meme joyous. joyous. Uh, the other thing that I like about this is, um, and there's actually a companion app to this called Pfolio, and that's for Google Photos, is that it has a really great slideshow functionality. Um, so I think I'm going to do it here from Sailor Moon. So here's like the Sailor Moon folder, right? Let's pretend this is a bunch of pictures. And so all I have to do is hit the plus button and it'll immediately start the slideshow, which is like super easily castable to whatever is, whatever you're connected to. Um, I found that like Google photos and Google, like, first of all, doing stuff from Google drive to Chromecast is kind of hard. Uh, and I kind of like that this enables that ability. Um, I also like that it lets you search through everything. It also does offline sync, just like the Google Drive does. Um, it also lets you take care of uploads, make new folders, show hidden albums. It's also got a bunch of settings. So you can control uh, what your starting folder is when you log in. If maybe there's a folder that you're always defaulting to, you can do a uh, forced download, you know, if you need to just like refresh things and you know, you don't want to wait for your system to do that. Um, you can adjust the display, whether it requires a passcode, um, whether photos fill the screen, whether they're auto-rotated. You can adjust the brightness by the day they're taken. Uh, you can add some gestures like pausing videos on touch. Um, you can use English instead of the default language if that's something that you need. <laughs> Force English. Um, which I, I would imagine that for some bilingual folks out there that maybe that's something that they want to use. You can add more accounts if you need um, to have those synced up. So it's just like for three bucks, it's just a really nice you know, way to kind of organize all that stuff that you have going in your Google Drive that maybe you want access to, but you don't want to go digging for. The other reason I sought out this drive is because I use Google Drive a lot to sync uh, work files between my Chromebook and my Pixel phone. Mm -hmm. So just to have this is nice and easy. So 
Chifolio. It's a Google Drive photo gallery and uploader. It also does auto uploads, um, just like Google Photos. Uh, if there oh. are folders on here that you want to have backed up specifically to Google Drive, I find that to be really helpful. Um, I'm just moving my life no more into the Google ecosystem so that it's easier for me when sure. I when I hop computers. Cool. That is G Folio, one word, the letter G Folio, uh, two ninety nine.